Greetings from beautiful South Florida. This is a 2008 Toyota Sienna Limited all-wheel drive. The vehicle's in beautiful condition, really in outstanding shape. Black with tan interior inside, navigation system, Bluetooth, backup camera, rear DVD system, really in outstanding shape. Leather all the way around, beautiful alloy wheels, really in outstanding shape. Super, super clean. Every option available, I believe, on this vehicle. Really in outstanding condition. 2008, it's got about 130,000 miles on it. Really in beautiful condition. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at this vehicle and see some of the features on it. Front bumper, beautiful shape. It does have parking sensors all the way around. Really nice. Front bumper's in beautiful shape. It does have this uh, braking system that was added in 2008, which is an option. When you have the cruise control on the car, actually, it brakes for you if you get too close to the other vehicle. Front headlights look brand new, really in outstanding condition. Grill, also in outstanding condition. Very nice. No humidity, no, ha no uh, haze in them, very nice. Puts in great condition, super clean. Really nice shine. It does have a couple little chip marks here and there. We did touch them up, but it's normal for a car with 130,000 miles. There's a couple little touch ups here we did. It's in really nice shape. We actually replaced the windshield. It's a brand new windshield. It had a couple chips in it, so we went ahead and replaced the windshield. It's got a brand new windshield, brand new battery, front fender. On the driver's side, on the passenger side, it's in beautiful condition. Don't see any marks or anything there to show. Very clean. Does have a small little dent right here on the passenger door. Glass mirrors, everything looks really nice. Also has another little dent I just saw here in the video on the power sliding door. Rear quarter panel on the passenger side looks very clean. It does have a little scuff right here in the edge. Let me show it right now. Got a small little scratch right there. Let me show it. Rear bumper, parking sensors. Very nice. It's got a small dent here on the rear door. And it has some touch up all the way around the edge there. And another little touch up here. Really nice. Rear bumper's in really good condition. It's got parking sensors. Very nice. Also has a backup camera. Rear glass is in outstanding condition. Very nice. Rear quarter panel on the driver's side. Super clean. Very nice condition. Small little dent right there by the, by the gas door. Power sliding door on the driver's side doesn't look like it have any dings or dents to show there. Driver door, very nice condition, no marks or anything. Front fender on the driver's side, really in outstanding shape, very clean. Taking a look at the roof, sunroof in beautiful shape, no scratches on the glass. The roof looks very clean, no dings, no dents to show. Really in outstanding condition. Very clean. Two thousand and eight Toyota Sienna Limited. Really in beautiful condition. And we're taking a look at the driver door panel. Door panels in outstanding condition, clean throughout. The vehicle does have memory seat for the driver. All the controls, really in outstanding shape. It's got a little Cubby space there to put stuff away. Cup holder on the door. It's got a light also, very nice. Taking a look at the seat. The seat's in beautiful condition. Really in nice shape. Let's take a look at that armrest. Armrest in really nice shape. Look at that. The seat's in really nice shape. Normal wear and tear here on the edge. It does have a little imperfection here. The 
size that's in beautiful condition. It does have lumbar support. Take a look at the rugs, very nice. Steering wheel's in beautiful shape. It's got that wood accent on there. Really in outstanding condition. Very nice. So we're taking a look at the passenger side front door panel. Really in outstanding condition. It's brand new. It's got a little storage compartment here. Really nice to have that. Controls look nice. Cup holes are on the door. A little extra there. Power seat for the passenger. It does have a little bit of wear and tear here, as you can see here. Besides that, the seat's in really nice shape all the way through. Very nice. Let's take a look at the armrest, also in beautiful condition. Clean throughout. Rugs look clean, very nice condition. We're gonna go ahead and take a look at the sliding door on the driver's side. On the remote here, you could open up with the remote. Hold down the button, the door opens up perfectly, no issues at all. As you can see here, rugs are in beautiful condition, very nice. Up above, fold down TV, DVD player, standard from Toyota on this model. Seats are in beautiful condition. Look at that. Really an outstanding shape. Very nice. Looks brand new back here. Beautiful condition. Let's go ahead and flip this forward. Take a look at the third row seat. It's got a little latch back here you pull. Folds forward. Lots of room to get back there. Third row seat is in beautiful condition. Looks like it's never been touched. Really an outstanding shape. Rugs on the bottom here are also clean throughout. Very nice condition. Now let's go ahead and we'll close the sliding door. You could actually press the button or you can pull on the handle here. And it'll close automatically for you. Beautiful feature. You can use them manually also if you'd like. We're going to go ahead and take a look at the passenger side sliding door. I'm gonna go ahead and grab it here from the remote, press the button, door opens up automatically, very nice. Taking a look at the rear seat on the passenger side, outstanding condition, look at that. Armrests are in beautiful shape, headrest, seats look really nice on this vehicle, super clean, outstanding condition. Let's go ahead and take a look at the third row, it's got a little thing here you pull back here, folds forward. You can take a look at the third row seat. Also in outstanding condition, very nice. Super clean. Beautiful condition. Now to close it, we can close it with the button or you can just pull the handle. Closes beautifully, look at that. No issues at all. We're gonna take a look at the cargo area in the back. We're gonna go ahead and open it up with the button on the remote. There you go, hold it down, lid comes up, very nice, let's go ahead and take a closer look at the storage compartment, it's in really nice shape, keep in mind this is a 2008 with about a buck 30 on the clock, really in nice condition, on the side here it has an inverter, you can plug in a gaming system or whatever on it, 12 volt plug here also. This car is really cool because you can store these seats down. What you do is you pull this one here, that falls down, bring it down like this. There goes one. In case you gotta carry something large or whatever, you can definitely do it. One hand. Very nice, look at that. A lot of storage space there. Beautiful. Now, for the power door, it doesn't have a button on it. All you gotta do is just pull on it. And as soon as you pull on it, it'll activate it and it'll close on its own. Fully functional, no issues at all. Very nice. Inside this 2008 Toyota Sienna Limited all-wheel drive with navigation and rear DVD system factory. I'm gonna go ahead and start this baby up. In. You can see there all the lights turn on and off. And it doesn't have any issues with check engine or anything like that. Go ahead and lower the, the radio. 
AC is running nice. This vehicle has 131,446 miles. Everything's fully functional. Let's take a look at some of the features on this vehicle. Of course, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. Got rear power vents. This car does have, uh, I believe it's uh, those high intensity headlights. You can control them actually with this height here. It's got power sliding doors on the sides and a rear power sliding power hatch. It's got a memory seat for the driver. Really cool, it has folding mirrors. Check it out how that works. That's the one on the driver's side. And that's the one on the passenger side. So let's open them up again. Another cool feature these mirrors have, it has turning signals on it. So it's got a little thing that blinks there, shows you. Really cool at night when you see it. Let's go ahead and order, open up the rear, the rear vents. And you can see they're both working. One here, one on the other side. And we'll close all in. Fully functional, no issues at all. It's got steering wheel radio controls. It does have Bluetooth. It has a distance braking system. So when you have the cruise control on and you're driving, this is like a really cool feature for 2008. Uh, it actually brakes for you when it gets too close to a car. Really cool. It's got the voice command. You can actually look for an, a, a thing on your navigation through the voice command. This is the controls for the cruise control. It's for the, the wipers, the rear wipers. It's got automatic lights. Fog lights, really nice. It's got a JBL symphony system, navigation, Bluetooth, DVD in the back for the kids, CD in dash, climate control AC for three zones. It's got parking sensors all the way around. See that little thing there? That's the van. All the way around, they'll have little dots. It'll tell you when you get too close to something while you're driving. You can see there are all the controls for the, for the AC. It's got heated seats for the driver and passenger in the front, fully functional. You can see the lights turn on there. Automatic transmission. It's got two power plugs here. It's got a lot of storage down here. Little cubby hole there. It's got a cup holder there dual cup holders here. It's got a little compartment here where you can put a little pad or whatever to write stuff down. We've got the remote in here. On the bottom it's got a storage down there with cup holders for the rear passengers. Really nicely equipped. I'll tell you. Over here we have two glove boxes, one on top, one on the bottom. Full set of books. We'll take pictures of those and show them to you. It's got a, a button here to turn on the, the rear power inverter for you can plug in a gaming system. It's got a, a little plug for the auxiliary. Hazards, rear defrost. This you can control all the lights inside the car so you can turn them on or off or put the door or you can turn them off completely in case the kids turn them on you don't have to climb back there and turn it off yourself. So let's go ahead and take a look through the radio. The screen that's on right now is the actual uh, navigation map. You go to menu, you can set up your settings there. Go to destination, you can look for destinations, current position. And let's say a restaurant, you want to find something. Let's say you want to find an Italian restaurant, you press OK. Show a list. We'll show you the, the closest restaurants nearby with the mileage and all that stuff, which is pretty cool. We'll go back to destination again. You can enter an address if you'd like. It's got a lot of cool things here. Very nice. It's got a tilt, so let's say for some reason you're getting a glare on the screen, you can adjust it, which is nice. You can control the display, the audio. Very nice. Fully equipped, really amazing condition. You can 
set up users for the navigation. It's got a lot of settings here. It's got a lot of stuff you can do. Information here. You can go into the into the maintenance, the telephone, calendar, language, and Bluetooth your phone here. Make phone calls right through the Bluetooth right there, which is really cool. It's a nice feature. Okay, so I mean that pretty much covers a lot of the features inside here. Up above, we have all the power sliding door buttons. This is for the sunroof, the rear hatch, driver passenger uh, sliding doors. It has a compass, destination till empty. Really cool, it has garage door openers you can program. This is nice. It's got a little mirror built in here for you can take a look at the kids in the back or whatever. Really nice. Let's go ahead and test the sunroof. Sunroof roof is working perfect. No issues at all. It's got an automatic dimming mirror. This is a nice feature. Really a nice condition. Take a look at the dashboard, beautiful shape. It's got a little mark here, a little mark here. But I mean, overall, very nice condition for the age and the mileage. Really an outstanding shape. Stay tuned, we'll go ahead and take it for a test drive in a moment. Definitely a cool feature. It's got a backup camera. When you put the car in reverse, it'll actually pop up there and show you which way you're going, which is pretty cool. Nice feature. Sitting in the back seat here, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the DVD player in the rear. It's got a little button here, fold down like that, opens right up. All the controls here are on top, the menu controls are here. DVD goes in here, eject is there. Does come with a wireless remote control, original. It says rear entertainment system. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and uh, put the DVD in. As soon as you put the DVD in, it's gonna go ahead and start playing. Now you could buy wireless headphones for it. It's got the wireless connection here. We don't have the headphones for it, but you can buy them. Or you could get just some regular wire headphones and plug one in here on the side and another one on this side. The DVD is already starting to play. Now you can listen to it through the radio or if you want to use the headphones you can use it that way. So I'm going to go ahead and select and then we'll go ahead and select in the front here. It's going to see there it's going to play whatever's on the DVD. Looking at the volume and stuff. So that's the actual DVD playing right there. Is allowing the body to experience moving in and through pauses. Trusting in your breath. If you find a pose too challenging, there you go. Sounds really cool. And then meet us back in center. We'll go ahead and bring this down. And then to stop the DVD, all we do is uh, press eject, take the DVD out. Fold up the TV and you're all done. Very nice. Sitting in the back seat here, uh, this vehicle does have rear shades, just a nice feature. That's on the sliding door. And then for the rear passengers in the third row seat, it also has another shade that come up, which is nice if you have a baby or something, you can put it there and protect it from the sun. Very nice. It's on both sides. That's a shape there, another shape back there. It does have AC on the roof. Four ACs coming from up here. Very nice. It's got the controller right up above, which is also very nice. Look at that there. It's got the digital thing that says low, high. Really nice. And then it also has buttons here on the side. You can press the button to open the door or you can pull right here to open the door. Very nice. We're already on the road here. So you can take a look how the vehicle drives. Give it a little quick test drive. 
We're going about 40 miles an hour right now. Drives perfect, no issues at all. Really smooth on the road. These vans are known for being really nice rides. Start braking a little bit. Feel for the brakes. Brakes feel good. Definitely drives nice. 2008's got about 130,000 miles and it drives really nice. Everything is fully functional. No issues at all. Super clean throughout. Really well equipped. Definitely a nice vehicle. Car drives perfect. Okay, well that's going to conclude our little test drive. Stay tuned, we're going to take a look at the cargo area and we'll take a look under the hood. We're taking a look under the hood of this 2008 Toyota Sienna Limited all-wheel drive. The car's in beautiful condition. Engine compartment is clean and in outstanding condition. Look at that. Looks all original. Has a brand new battery. We just put that on probably like a month ago. Brand new battery. Car looks very clean under the hood. As you can see here, all the, the fenders in the front have the VIN stickers, all original, super clean throughout. Look at that, beautiful, very nice, 2008 Toyota Sienna, limited, really in outstanding condition. We're taking a look at the driver's side front tire, tire's in really good shape, good amount of tread on there, looks nice. Rim is clean and in great condition. Does have some little scratches in here and there, as you can see. Does have some imperfections, but overall in really nice condition. Okay, we're taking a look at the rear tire. On the driver's side, tire has a good amount of tread on there. Look at the tread, looks really good. Rim is clean and in great shape. Does have some imperfections around here. It's got some scratching and stuff on there. Besides that, it's in really nice condition. Okay, we're taking a look at the rear tire passenger side. The tire has a good amount of tread on there, looks good. The rim is clean and in good condition. It does have some imperfections here and here. Besides that, it's in really nice shape. Okay, we're taking a look at the front tire on the passenger side. The tire is in really good shape. The rim is clean and in great condition. It does have some imperfections here and here on the edge. Besides that, it's in beautiful condition.